Is there something you need, Jedi? Make it good, for I have little patience. You are far from the first Jedi who has come here after all, willing to abandon that decrepit... Who am I? You must not have been in Korriban for very long. Either that or you have been feeling it. Luckily for you, I am... I am the one who decides which of the... <laughs> An interesting question and not one I... We wield ultimate power, my friend. To be a Sith is to taste freedom and to know victory. Nothing is as glorious as bending the Force to your will. We make no apologies for the weak. If you cannot clench your fist and know when the moment comes to strike, there is no place for you amongst us. Of those who come to train, those who are weak return home. If they are both weak and foolish, they die. But it was their choice to come. You know the name. Malak is the strongest of us, and the strongest always rules. At least until one who is stronger can take it from him. That is our way. Survival of the fittest. You are always on guard, always lean for the kill. We promote it, for through this, the Sith are stronger. If a Sith is proven to be weak, and if the time is right, the Force rewards the cunning and the mighty. Step up to the challenge if you dare, or turn tail and run. We make no apologies for the weak. Of those who come to... You've heard enough, have you? <laughs> so what is it to be? Nah. <laughs> okay. Ah, so you are just another hopeful after all. Or are you? There is something odd about you that I cannot place. Obviously, you are a Jedi. One who is very strong in the Force, it seems. So were you a part of the Order for very long? Did they train you? No, I don't know what you're talking about. As I thought. How interesting that they would let one with such power out of their grasp. Or are you here to spy on us? For all the good it would do. With that kind of power, you could become a great Sith. Perhaps, if I let you. Does that interest you? Ah, good. Exactly the sort of answer I was hoping for. I will take you to the Academy. And we shall see if you are ready to join the ranks of the Sith. I have only one other question. These companions of yours, they will not be coming with you, I presume? Statement. Just a simple droid here, ma'am. Nothing to see. Move along. I see. <laughs> Fair enough. So long as they do not disturb your training or cause any trouble. Okay, are you ready hopefully. to go to the Academy, then? Then let us leave. The master of the academy awaits you. Please don't give me dark side points. Please don't give me dark side points. Uh, okay, because I'm trying to go light side here. Yeah, just don't mind the Wookiee. Greetings, prospective students. It appears we have a late entry. Who do you bring before me, Uthura? A young human bristling with the Force? A human that has had some training, it seems, Master Uthar. Very promising, I think. That I'll judge for myself, thank you. Tell me, human. 
What do you know of the ways of the Sith? What preconceptions has your mind been polluted with? Uh, I know more than the Sith than you, I've just begun. Uh, I know the Sith are powerful in the Force, so they recognize the Sith. The Sith are evil and surround themselves with the temptation of corrupt their power. The Sith do what they want, play with the chaos, no right. Wait, I, I'm, I'm gonna get my... I have still too many fish I have. Okay, let me see if I can... Indeed. Then perhaps you would care to demonstrate for us the powers of a Sith Master. No? Then perhaps you shall keep your foolishness to yourself and actually learn something. <laughs> Wait, tell these idiots to learn that. I'm actually Darth Revan. Dark with weakness. I bet, like, a mouse just goes That is their tradition. You it is truly fucking no surprise idiots. They cling to it you just brought Darth Revan in here. We, however, do not like, treat the Force as a burden. Because we treat I it know as his a face. Thing to be celebrated. We use it to acquire power Shit. over others. This and why should we not? Because the Jedi say we should not. We are as the Force is meant to be. The Jedi would hide that from you. <laughs> they would tell you the dark the side is too quick, they too easy. Fucked with Darth Vader. Also that they need never challenge the passions that lie within them. Joining with us means realizing your true potential. It means not stifling yourself solely for the sake of hidebound shamans and their antiquated notion of order. Be what you were meant to be. What say you, Lasho? Are you ready to learn the secrets of the dark side? Dare you? I dare, Master Uthar. I am ready. Brash and fiery, as expected. Turn that cup oh, 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 oh. Are you ready? Uh -huh. I am, Master. More than ready. I sense much anger within you, young one. That is good. That will provide you power. And Shardan, what of you? I am always ready. I see. You had best gather your wits for the trial ahead, boy, or you will not last. And you, young human, does this interest you? Are you ready to... Are you? I can see into your heart, young human, and I see the dark kernel that is there. Oh, is ready no, to just don't mind him. Just start to running see. inside my Now mind. then. All of yeah, you five yeah, funny story. Oh, Darth Maul is like shot before. Darth Revan. You all just, have the potential yeah, he, to become true. Yeah, I had mind wiped him, and then here Only I am. Just Darth Revan's just behind we'll me. We'll succeed. Don't mind The one who succeeds asshole. will be admitted to the academy as a full Sith. And all a nerd to next year Sith. and try again. But hey, I'm on the good side. My pupil, you if you want Darth Revan, shall be your teacher and master while you attempt to prove yourselves. Heed her words. As Master Uthar said, none of you are true Sith yet. For that to occur, one of you must do enough of worth, gain enough prestige to be selected. What yeah, is an yeah. act of worth? You must learn that for yourselves. Remember that you are competitors here. Fight for your destiny, or go home. If you wish to gain a lead over your competitors, the first of you to learn the code of the Sith and tell me of it will be rewarded. The rest is for you to discover. Welcome to the dark side, my children. Your so one chance at true greatness lies here. Sith code. Oh. Ah, fuck. <sighs> okay, just all level up. Just all level up. Fuck. God damn it. I think it's not that much. I mean, hopefully I can hit the light side ending. I'm just in the morally gray area right now. Okay, so I know the Sith code. I've looked it up. Passion, strength, power, victory, the force. Peace is a lie. There is only passion. Through passion I gain strength. Power, I gain victory. Through victory, I change and process. The force tells destiny. 
And I actually knew most of that, because you know why? Red Darth Vader. Yeah, I'm just gonna say that the first book is probably like an official guidebook for the Sith. Ah, there you are. My favorite prospect for the year. Absolutely. By my estimation, you are far more likely to achieve the prestige necessary to join the Sith than any of the others. Well, I'm probably As gonna do that. Fact, I am so certain of that that I'm willing to offer you an opportunity of the once-in-a-lifetime variety. Would you like to hear it? Good. I do so adore someone who's willing to take a chance. As I said, you're no doubt going to be the one whom Uthar chooses to become a Sith. With my help, of course. Once that occurs, he will take you into the Valley of the Dark Lords to the tomb of Nagasado to administer the final test. There you and I will be alone with him. The perfect time to, shall we say, arrange for a change in the Academy's leadership. The tomb is an ancient ruin on the surface that was You're visited years ago by Darth Revan I've and Darth heard Malak. Of the of Darth they Lord, discovered like a star map there of great importance. Reaching read that map as is part book. of the final test. At any rate, to read it the tomb year, is important. That Uthar will be alone is what is important. Don't worry, I'm just doing something real quick. Um, holy crap, that was a lot. Is it just random? Is that such a daunting prospect? It is not as if I'm asking you to perform the task alone, or as if you will get nothing out of it. Master Uthar cannot prevail against us both. That's all there is to it. It is a very simple matter. Oh, okay. I guess that makes sense. <laughs> and so it should. It is central to our beliefs. Oh, no, no, I wasn't talking about that. To replace my master when I'm strong enough. Sith that should not be named, like not a target. I'm so glad you see it, my. I will begin to make preparations. Like the for Valley of the Dark Lords is where at, uh, your only worry now is, is actually where Don't the thing is. Disappoint me. Is, is actually where the, the your, your star map is. I have been involved in the work there over the last couple of years, but not often. Most of the excavating is left to the students. What did you wish to know? Is there any way into the tomb of Naga Kado? Not unless you are accompanied by Master Uthar, no. It is strictly forbidden. And I truly doubt you could bypass the doors to the tomb with anything less than ship blasters. Even then, perhaps. Oh, so basically impossible. None. I do not even know how Master Uthar gains entrance to tell the truth, though I look forward to discovering that fact. I have searched many times, so do not bother. There is no other way. Do not fret, however. Simply get the prestige you need, and you will see the tomb soon enough. Okay. We could learn much about the history of the ancient Sith, why they were on Korriban, and why they left. Perhaps you know what? Since we're on the Sith Academy, I might as well do. With that Full on review of Darth power. Bane, path of path to destruction. Is there any other way? Sure enough. As you wish. You must impress Master Uthar. Go to him with news of your deeds or artifacts you have discovered. The first and easiest way would be for you to learn the code of the Sith and speak it to him. I can oh, okay. teach you that. Shall I go on? There are a group of students who refused an order by Master Uthar to execute a group of civilians in the colony. Uthar declared that they were to be executed themselves. 
But the students escaped and fled before the order could be carried out. We are certain that they have not left Korriban. No doubt they have not gotten far and are simply in hiding. We just do not know where exactly. If you were to locate them and carry out Uthar's order, I am sure he would be most appreciative. Shall okay. I go on? I would suggest you talk to the other prospective Sith and find one you can gain an advantage with. I believe Lasho would be an excellent choice. She is I actually trusted. might go to the dark I side. I doubt here. you could talk her into letting I don't know why. help her. But, uh, somehow. I think I might Just make sure it is you who gains the advantage, not her. I have no idea you how I'm actually going to get students. back since I did all the That is the only stuff thing that will impress Ethar. The only other idea I can suggest to you if I do return to the dark side and get the dark side on the surface, I think there are ruins I actually there might explore. Uh, do it's this possible first you might find some artifacts or information in them which would please you. I might actually do this first to scale the dark side points out of the way. Revan? You mean Darth Malak's former master? Very little. I never met him personally, though I heard he was a very powerful man. Very charismatic. In the end, fuck. Revan was out Darth Revan, Revan you son of a bitch. Such is the way of the Well, I guess if I'm actually going to become Darth Revan, Revan next time, I might as well get my charisma on. Anything is possible. Uthar's former master still lives, though he is in no condition to challenge his former pupil for leadership. Perhaps the same is true for Revan. Perhaps Revan is out there, somewhere, waiting to take revenge upon Malak. Yeah. More likely, what we were told somewhere. is the truth. Revan is dead. Malak would be foolish to leave his old master alive, considering all the knowledge Revan held. Well, if you found out how he actually... Is there any reason I should? Beside the fact I did not know Revan in life, Revan was known for wearing a full helmet and cape. Perhaps Revan's body had been disfigured by the power of the Force. It is not unheard of. Regardless, well, yeah, I doubt I shall be meeting Revan anytime soon. Disfigured as hell. Both Revan and Malak came to Korriban when they discovered the tomb of Nagasado. That was before my time. Fair enough. All right. You have had an excellent. Okay. Just hopefully I won't get any more dark side points if I'm going to light. And if I am going dark side, I might as well get, I might as well keep doing horrible shit. Okay, so. Hey. Hey. Okay. I know the Sith code. I can so I can do that first. It's probably like I know that way better than the Jedi code. Um. Uh, hey. Yo. Uh. I want to tell you something. Greetings, young one. You have much to do yet. You have gained little prestige. Okay, okay, uh, I want you to... I want to know some more about you. Uh, the only way... Oh, it is... Observation. We could begin by slaughtering the inhabitants of this building, Master. <laughs> really, however, you should seek out Uthura <laughs> and get fuck? her advice. <laughs> she is your trainer, you doing? Like, yes? um, Master... There is an exit that leads to the surface of the planet. The valley is only a short trip from there. It is Okay, um... Uh... You wish to know more ab I strived many years. There is nothing else you need to know. Okay, fine. Fuck you, then. Um... Indeed. You have... Um... Even though I'm talking to him, is this not the right guy to talk to? Alright, so I need to figure out where he is. Okay, okay. Oh, that's Cal. Oh, uh, hello. I don't remember seeing you here before. My name is Kel. Kel Algwin. <laughs> Nothing. Uh, 
Yes, my master always says I'm too trusting, too willing to show weakness. You're a Sith, so I, I really shouldn't, you know. Oh, I know that. I mean, you aren't yet, but you intend to be. I mean, you're just like everyone else here. Well, I, I, I didn't mean it like that. I, I shouldn't trust you. I can't trust you, can I? Don't do the force persuade. I just don't feel I belong here. I thought maybe I did at first, but now, I don't know. I just have so many doubts. Ah, uh, yeah, that's what Josh Bain did. After this, I probably won't want to hear that. Oh, yeah, I should probably talk about that. But where would I go then? What would I do? Uh, I, I don't know. I never really thought about it. Maybe I should seek it out. Give it a try. Thank you. Thank you so much. Ah, oh, there's the light side points. Let me just check how much. And that's very little. Alright, so I should probably talk about Darth Bane while I'm walking around. Ah, uh, and that's no, that's probably a bad idea. It would make too much sense. So, Darth Bane. Now, nah, nah, when I actually started to do some real quick talking about it, that makes way more sense because I started out. Okay, let's just, um, okay, let's go talk to my master real quick, or, shit, I'm lost. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, hey, 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 hey. What do you wish? I can help you understand. Peace is a lie. Through power, simple Yeah, 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 I know. Let me just... The Jedi would have you believe that peace is a desirable goal. That peace of the spirit is the way the Force is mastered. That a lack of conflict betters man. We know different. It is our passion, our hate, and our desire that fuels the Force. It is conflict that improves the lot of civilization and single being both. Conflict forces one to better oneself. It forces change, growth, adaption, evolution, or death. These are not our laws, but the universe's. Without conflict, you have only stagnation. Through passion, I gain strength. What fuels your power with the Force but your passion? The stronger, darker emotions. Anger, strength, hatred, I gain passion. fear. These passions <laughs> empower All right, so Darth Bane is just about this slowly dell, like, miner on a outer rim planet, which the Republic... Cares about because you know how their movies paint like the Republic as this big booming well, but world. Oh uh, no, <laughs> this is like awfully negative fashion. Jedi said the opposite. Oh, can both be right? It is our goal to be stronger, to okay. achieve our potential, and so, not rest upon our laurels. And like. We are the seeds. He, and he's just basically has, like, the most shitty life possible. Like, just imagine a shitty life. This guy has... Oh. No. Uh, through strength, I gain power. The stronger you become in the Force, the more power you will achieve. 
but always must be the them all. Your pal. Without strife, your, your victory has no meaning. Without strife, Dude, you do not terrible to him. Without strife, you know, funny, so there is like only stagnation. Fuck that kid up. Fuck him up. By fighting. And worst of all, he has to work in this crappy mine for ten hours. Yeah, but hey, the bartender likes him. And through power, I gain victory. How many sorts of victories can you imagine? Peaceful victory, victory by sacrifice, a truce, an achievement. Unless the victory is achieved by demonstrating that your power is superior, it is only an illusion. Yep. Temporary at best. We seek more. Alright, so, and through victory, I... And through victory, my chains are broken. This has been argued over, and often. The yep. chains represent and our restrictions. Like, the Republic Both gets into a fight. Us. Over and those a card game themselves. that was a Ultimately, the goal of any Sith votes is to free the Republic and the Jedi and say, yeah, that's why the way, Sith have probably way wish, more men because, well, much not a lot of people. One who has freed so themselves from all so restrictions obviously this, they is would be perfection. Off their the potential fulfilled. For not like, perfect you know, strength, perfect power, perfect destiny, and much of that. That is our ideal at any rate. Well, it is said in Sith legend that, that, that the Sithari, but, the perfect being, like, will one day lead us. These guys but like, perhaps which that is just asshole. a legend. And he accidentally kills one of the Republic. So, um, if you can't see... I wonder what that being would be like. If you can see the why, legends say the Sithari would destroy us and make us stronger than ever. He but perhaps he might just instantly a become a Republic Perfection is a goal, prisoner, think, rather than a safe or, like, being. Execute the Jedi would argue that, no doubt. Force. The Force is our servant and our master, our teacher yep. and our companion. And uh, he just and the no bartender friend and says, "Yo, I can get you master to the Sith master the universe. I can get you to the Sith Empire. The shall reward and you won't ever see me again, but I pray that you'll have fun." And then, like months later, I am not surprised. The Force. Okay. You have had an and excellent. So, like after that, he thanks him and then leaves and never gets seen on that planet ever again. And with that, he basically becomes Darth Vader. I know, I'm pretty scared. But after the, all that, yo, 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 I, I, I found out the Sith thing. And so, in the Sith army, he gets a lot of friends, he you have much to do in, well, you have gained but after a few missions, speed. oh yeah, I forgot to mention you how to he killed a Republic soldier, the others. he saw the blade, which is a micro blade, by the way, but he saw it with the force, and he also he killed his dad with it, you can guess why, and so, Bane, so, after, like, one incident where he basically attacked the entire Republic army, on his own with a bunch of misfits uh the, the, and everyone realizes oh shit i think this guy has the force so they pick him up and after it's revealed how much how much the sith want him he's like okay i'll join you he basically says fuck you to all his friends and bec and leaves his own name leaves his name. and uh that's the end of part one he basically becomes darth Bane, or Bane at the moment, because he hasn't given himself the dark ti Darth power. Why? Because the this Sith Empire is connectful and not betrayal at all, except that's entirely what the Sith need. Then finish the peace is a lie that is only. Go. Passion. Through passion, I gain. Through strength, I gain. Through power, I gain. Through victory. The force shall free me. Yes, good. You have indeed learned the code of the Sith. Speaking the words and knowing the words are, however, Two different things. Tell me then, true or false, victory by any means is desirable. C, here's C real quick, let me just...
Well done. I will test you no more. You know the code. Very impressive. Go now. You have done well, but you have not impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. Oh? What is my apprentice up to now? I see. It is good that you have come to me with this information, young one. It is a bit ironic that Euthura has begun her plotting. I yep, have been yeah, aware of her yeah, growing ambitions for some time, and had in fact already decided to remove her. Normally, the one who gains the most prestige would engage in a final trial. Two of the students would fight. This time, it will be Euthura who battles, though she does not yet know it. Perhaps it will be you who combats her. Yes, perhaps so. This is what you can do. Give this pad to Adrenus. He will put some poison in her bath. This will weaken Euthura for that final test, making her an easy target. Rather generous of me, don't you think? For coming to me with this information and betraying your foolish trainer, I feel you are worthy of prestige, young one. Go now. You have not yet impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. Okay. Very well. You have impressed me. Definitely a good start. All right. Uh, yes, we need to find the seal. Double, the double cross, double cross. Uh, so we need to locate under a thing. All right. So I need to find wherever that, <laughs> wherever the fuck that is. And um, this way. This is this is supposed to be the way. Door to the right. Did you get the wrong model? Cause why is he talking like that? Sorry. <laughs> Slimo podo na rundi hodunga ku hunka be. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you. Managed to get game some completed. Uh, we have yet to declare a victor. And we speak to you for the end of our year. Okay, so I'm gonna take a little break. And then later I'll just tell you more about the Darth. Oh, oh yeah, I should probably tell you that that's not actually how they talk. It's just how I felt like talking about it. But. That's basically the events that happen. Like, sure, there's a few little details that I missed, like in the speech about him being, like, Darth Bane with no formal title. But, like, it gets way better. Like, that, sure, that's not like a strong opening, which it is. But, that's only the opening. It's gonna get a lot, a lot better and epic. So I'm just gonna save and uh, stop here. And since I not really want to play Dynasty with Rex anymore, it's going to save Rex. Uh, I think I'm just gonna be doing this. Hi. Okay. Let's do. I have to go talk to my map, to my trainer, to tell her that. Alright, let's 
Exactly. So we have to go tell our trainer that that he knows. I understand you have impressed Master Uthar at least a little. That is good. We are one step closer toward completing my plan. Were I you, I would not get too excited just yet. Yeah, yeah. You still yeah. have plenty left to do. What? What's happened? Our plan is still intact, I hope. Ah, how very clever of him. Normally you would face some other student in the tomb, preferably one of the failed ones. Obviously Uthar has decided to get rid of me. But why? Did you say something to him? Uh... <laughs> I truly doubt that. You are attempting to play... If you think Uthar will truly be so grateful to you for double-crossing me, think again. In the end, it works out better that it is only the two of us in the tomb with him. So long as we refuse to fight. Is there anything else I should know? Good. I'm not about to... Here. This pass card will allow you access to Uthar's quarters. It's at the far end of the passages with the other quarters. Take this device as well, and put it inside his cot. No one should see you do it. Then Uthar will be too weak to stand up against us. Don't even think of failing me. You and I are too far into this now to back out. Yep. Well, that was easy to find. It's just right over here. Oh, don't worry. I will be talking about Dark Plane soon, I promise. Anything else to do? Oh, there's another thing in here. Oh, I guess not. Okay. Okay, so I guess we're on to the final test. Let's just go. All 
Alright, so everything is ready. Don't mention the poison part to her. Get it down. Because this is zone 10. Good? Good. Alright, so Darth Bane, Act 2. Path of Dark. So this is where the, all the Sith stuff starts up. And not like... Because it was introducing Bane. That was what the first act was all about. It was introducing Bane. That was all it was. Yeah, that's where this is where all the Darth like Sith stuff is found. Basically, just plain. And she's like, ugh, this stuff is boring. And also, by the way, in the book's word, or like, translated from the book's word, hot. In fact, Bane actually likes her, and talks to her, even if she gets attracted to her. But, uh, you don't get to get because she's not like So, he becomes like the main thing. Well, he like, he becomes like the hot guy. He was feeling a bit guilty, and also because he found out how he was also part of it. But when he gets into it, he decides to make Bane his partner in Sith Primal. And so, he awakens that anger and that spark in him, but he hangs out in the library a lot. They probably left out the parts where <laughs> Master 
Master's, Master's of the New Sith, like, hey, why, why is, isn't the Sith library more open? Another reason why, like, this isn't like this kind of Sith Empire, no, it's kind of more, uh, this is like a new Sith Empire. After this. Oh. it's called the Brotherhood of the Come in like the Sith and the Sith Empire didn't like the how the old Sith Empire was run, so they thought it was too fighter and like fight based, and they wanted it to be like the Jedi. But Bane was, was like, uh, uh, Sith you know, like the seat. goes tired and goes to the valley. But like everyone has told him, uh yeah. There must have been something. And uh yeah, it turns out uh it was and they were pretty much right and he like was gone for weeks. Like no food and only like horses making him making himself go on. But he eventually did return it. But he had a new goal. Because he felt the presence of something else. Another planet. But yeah, he does gain it. And that's where he decides, you know what? I'm going off to where the Star Forge was. But, like, if you know what this is, it's not really a spoiler. First of all, Star Forge. And also, After this, he finally learns. And he finally finds, guess what? A Sith altar. Yeah. Yeah, like 
all that artwork about Darth Bane. Yeah. Yeah, that's where it came from. Pretty much the act two. And pretty much the rest of the book is being screwing around with this. It's probably my two favorite characters. <laughs> That was basically Act 2, and a little, I mean, I think it was the third Act 3, and that was the, oh yeah, he killed the assassin. Hold it right there, whoever you are. We're, we're not going back to the Academy. We'll kill you rather than go back. So what is it then? If you're not here to kill us or bring us back, why are you here? Speak up! So you have heard about us. Yes, we ran away before Master Uthar could execute us. Is that so hard to believe? My name is Thalia May. The others here and myself refused to murder a bunch of people on a whim from Master Uthar. So here we are. We thought that becoming a Sith huh. was what we always wanted, but that wasn't true. Now all we want is to get out of here. Fair enough?
help us? Why should I believe that this isn't some kind of trick? You want to help us? All right, I can think of a way. We're Good. stuck in these caves, obviously, or we would have been long gone. There's a passage to the surface through the caves, but we're blocked by some kind of large... If you could kill it and clear up the pass... It... It's clear? We can go. Thank you. This... I wasn't expecting help from anyone in the Academy. I guess we aren't the only ones who don't... agree with everything. Maybe. Maybe the Jedi will accept us. I've seen how evil the dark side is. Maybe I could try. At any rate, hopefully I'll again. see you in the sequel. You've saved our lives. Okay. Pain for a while, so might as well get used to it. Here. Oh, no, there she is. Hey. I remember you from the colony. You seem all right, though you'll not win the right to train before me. You don't remember? My name is Lasho. We met in the colony ever so briefly. Just figure that out, did you? <laughs> it just so happens that I have a surefire way of pulling ahead in this little contest of ours. You don't really have a chance. I found an artifact that will impress Uthar far more than anything you could ever scrounge up. I'll win for sure. I don't have it just yet. I'll get it when I'm good and ready. 
<laughs> like I would tell you. Why don't I just let you rob me while you're at it? So what if it is? I'll get it eventually, regardless. Nothing good comes without a bit of a fight. That's the Sith motto, more or less. You go ahead and think that. I'll enjoy the look on your face when I win. I remember you from the colony. You seem all... <sighs> Forget it. I'm not gonna be tricked so easily. Just move along now. I remember you from... I'll get more prestige. Uh, how long is my first raid? Oh yeah, I forgot. Why did I pick soldier? I remember you. <sighs> Forget it. I remember you. Help me get it? I don't know. Hmm. I suppose I could use some help. The yard. Forget it. I remember you. For <sighs> Forget it. I remember Fun. you. Accept my Help offer. me get it? Hmm. I suppose. Accept these two things. Flattery, is it? I oh, suppose it's possible you. that Master Uthar could award both of us prestige. We'd be ahead of the others, for sure. Unfortunately, the Holocron lies in the gullet of the Tukata mother. I can arrange for us to meet her, but you're going to have to help me in putting her down. That makes sense to you? Go into the valley when you're prepared enough. I'll be amongst the central pillars near the north end. Remember, the central pillar's in the valley. I'll be waiting, so don't take too long. Yes, this mirror is great. They have... All the girls, for some reason, have blue. Oh, wait, no, I remember who made this now. Okay. I think this will give us enough prestige to actually make us be able to turn. She doesn't know I have a lot of good prestige. Let's go look around for her. Okay. Are you watching How to Train a Dragon? Cool.
Oh, she's right there. Oh. She's over there. Yes! Even though she just flat lied to me. There you are, finally. If you were any later in showing up, we would have had to abandon this. I've been calling to the Takata mother in their language. She should respond fairly. Ah, here she comes now. Oh, hi. Get ready. Wait, those things are not be easy. She's a tough beast. Well, I've killed some of them. Now I'm gonna put everything into One knuckle. <laughs> the beast is dead. We work better together than I would have hoped. And here is the holocron. Such a small thing to be so valuable and require so much effort to obtain. I'll just run along now and give this to Master Uthar. I'll be sure to tell him of your contribution, naturally. Forget it. I'm not waiting up for you. That wasn't our plan anyway. Over my dead body. Well, she she asked. <laughs> Probably could have been a way to say that being a Sith was wrong or something. <laughs> Oh god, she died. Big tragedy. She was such a prominent student. I know, right? It sucks. Oh man. Okay. Is everyone clear? Now, everyone, just pretend like none of that crap happened. Okay. Do not forget our agreement regarding. <laughs> I had heard that such an artifact existed. Tell me, young one, did you acquire the device by yourself? You lie. Still, what matters is the fact that you succeeded. And Lasho, does she yet live?
<laughs> well done. You gained an artifact through trickery and eliminated an opponent at the same time. Oh, yeah, it's probably that for, is <laughs> I forgot this is the search. You have impressed me enough, by my estimation, to become a So they basically are all about, like, Congratulations, tricking and young stuff. one. You have bested the others quite completely. You have but one final test which you must take, and this requires us to travel to the tomb of Nagasato in the Valley of the Dark Lords. I would advise you to be yes. rested and yep. equipped yep. before we leave. Return to your quarters now and seek me out in the morning. When you return, make sure that you have all you will need, for you will face your test alone. Go, and may the Force serve you well. Bye. Uh, Zabar, what are you doing, buddy? Where are you going over there for? So everyone, have you erased HK? Have you erased the memory banks of us doing this? Yes. All right, let's check out the third. Okay. What are you doing here? Go back to Uthar and tell him. What the fuck? I was seeing if you were still gonna talk to me. Okay, fine, fine, fine. I'll go do it. I'll go do your stupid quest. Hopefully I won't get any dark side points for this. Alright, I think this is like uh, the point where I basically don't have any dark side points. Oh, okay, so I have to actually go to this thing. Pretty sure you're actually supposed to. I think the, our my robes, the resin robes, are actually in there. Or it's locked. Maybe you have to have a key or something. Oh no, there it is. There, there it is. There's the key. So then, I take it you are ready to travel to the tomb of Nagasado. Your final test should not be delayed. It is a tomb that belonged to an ancient Sith Lord. The greatest of Korriban Sith Lords, in fact. It is there that your test is performed. Okay. I will tell you the details when we are there, young one. You will, however, fight for your life. That is why I suggest you be in sufficient health. Then we go now. Yay! Oh, bye, guys. See ya. <laughs> I'll be back. Uh, Aww, that's sad. HK Cross. Very well. We are now ready for your final test, young Sith. You have earned the right to see if you shall. Yeah, they don't know that I actually Indeed you have. screwed over the Is that a tone of mischief in your voice, dear Euthura? You should know by now that no scheme is certain. As should you, my master. But I was only agreeing with you. Should we not get on with the test? Yes. Yes, of course. We are in the sacred tomb of Nagasado, young one. The one discovered by Darth Malak and Darth Revan years ago. You are oh, to follow God. in their footsteps and reach the ancient star map that lies never. within. No. There you will find a lightsaber, amongst other things. The lightsaber is for you, your initiation present. Return to us once you have it. For oh. you, the test does not end there. Be very cautious here. This tomb is like the others in this valley, and many of its old defenses remain active. Do you understand what I have told you? Are you ready to begin? Can you tell me anything about Roe? No, that is fine. Okay, fine. Good. You thought. Yep, because that was entirely my plan. <laughs> Oh. Yep, this is the way. Alright, so save. Alright, so Darth Bane acts for me. Got the Alright. So So basically like it was pretty much what I said. So I haven't mentioned like the leader of this new Sith Order. Lord I want to say Zane, so 
Have the character. Yeah, the character. I do not think this is what. Oh yeah, it looks totally right. Okay, there we go. Oh yeah, and also, he pretty much, I forgot to mention earlier, that he pretty much ruined a farmer's life. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention that. Probably isn't good. Oh, Nagashard is here. Oh yeah, he also killed that Sharak guy earlier. Yeah, I, I, might, I forget stuff sometimes, but I do remember. Yep, here he is, Suri Khan, or Lord Khan. So, yeah, he was pretty much, like, the main leader. He, and after his vision about Darth Bane basically destroying what he created, he, um, got a little paranoid. <laughs> 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 didn't help that Bane was pretty much just goading him on when he actually did come back and say, oh yeah guys, turn over a new leaf, that old stuff sucked. <laughs> so can I join back with you guys? And pretty much getting me and Connor with that. I do not buy that he wants to join us. Like at all, he wasn't buying it at all. But he went along with it. Because he is, of course, all dark lord. And he wants to make the Sith great. It's too bad that he orderly sucks at everything. But yeah, he did become really paranoid. <laughs> Bane is like, hey, you know what will be perfect? Sith alchemy. Sith alchemy. Right? Right. I'm gonna have to kill you. Save. And, um, that's like the main half, like, that's the Darth Bane half. He really doesn't really show up that much. 
But this does eventually lead to probably the most crazy in the alley. But that involves like the other side of this of this war that's happening. basically takes like a back seat like it eventually leads like he thinks that gift me might be the perfect one but gift me is too like prequely for him but he's more you know it's more fun this way man and he's like okay we'll kill him and he sounds bad <laughs> Saying that's more like him, which eventually turns out to be, but it, he eventually uh, decides to trick him into going to this cave and doing this restricted ritual, which uh, will be revealed shortly. And so the second half of the third act is actually my favorite. This is two of my favorite. That probably no one has ever heard of. Like, there's this, like, Playboy Jedi that's pretty much like a huge um, Playboy. And then there's this book, Command. And their relationship is pretty cool. Especially as the pretty boy actually. Like that being a Jedi is meant to look like that. Especially when he actually takes up command from me. Cause at first, like, but they both. Like, the old guy really doesn't like him. Why is moving stop? I don't get why. Doesn't is pretty funny but they don't really appear much in it it's mostly severed around like on but <laughs> eventually Bane's plan gets in motion as he kills two birds with one stone some Jedi and the rest of the Sith Order yep It's awesome. And, um, you know what their put what Bane's plan was? That ritual? Basically, a big force bomb. 
I'm not joking. <laughs> pretty much probably the most epic, most tense stuff. Because <laughs> I was actually finishing it, like, probably a couple of hours before I actually had to go return. Probably the most tense stuff. The old guy, old Jedi guy dies, like the rest of his Jedi troops die. Then all the rest of the Sith dies along with Gifson. Well, she almost made it out because she broke from it and tried to run out. But uh, she didn't make it that far. <laughs> but, um, then after all that, Bane is just like, well, it's time to go into hiding. <laughs> And that's, and that's pretty much how the rule of two was beginning, but, and here's the last part, he meets a young girl, and she is named Rain, or, and she is pretty powerful now, but she was with her cousins and stuff, and they were growing force sensitive, so they're going to the Jedi, but, she, her ship crashed, and she separated from her cousins. But she had one friend. Public and Republic soldiers accidentally killed her. And they're like, oh, hey, are you okay? And she just went and killed them. And then minutes later, and she's like wailing, and then minutes later, and minutes later, Bane shows up, looks at what happened, he's like, I have nothing to do with this. <laughs> And he just looks at Xana, and, she, and he asks, Who are you? And you're not afraid of me? And Xana replies, pretty much like it, because she now hates, like, And she wants to be trained by him. And she'll win. And Bane is just like, <laughs> And then, I could have sworn at the end, Bane was just like, Turn to the camera. Smile. <laughs> like all those horrible, like, villains that actually <laughs> like, sm turn to a smile. The biscuit flips. <laughs> yep. And that's how the book ends. <laughs> Going straight into the second book. Which, which I read a little bit of, but I heard a little bit of, it, like, listen. They got to the part where they actually leave the world. <laughs> But I will only continue it if I get to good, if I decide to actually go back and finish up that book. So I'm gonna have to But don't worry, I will, like, probably during, like, Kotar 2, like after I'm done with Dune, uh, which is probably like a week away, I'm probably gonna focus on that, or I'm gonna focus a little bit more on the Fall of the Reach book, on the First Strike book of Halo, but I will eventually go to, to, uh, like Darth Bane 2, because I actually really want to do that. Since I'm getting b really back into Star Wars. Because I've fallen out like after. Bull crappy snipers. <laughs> or uh, as most people call it, outcasts. Jedi outcasts. Like, I agree with Rob. It's kind of bullshit. But it can be fun. But I'm not into that kind of game where you basically lost and then you die. Or know exactly what happened. I'm not in that. And here we go.
pretty far. I'm nearing to the last star map. Wow. Oh, oh yeah. What's the max level you can get on? I forgot. I never got that far. What, what, when you stop playing. Early twenties nine. Uh, over nine thousand. Oh, got two people. That's fine. Like in the early twenties. Ice grenade. Guess it wasn't around there. Really? You had to try and get it to the right.
I was supposed to use that. Oh, I have to go back. Well, at least it's just one. One. That's probably. Ooh. No, 
know, I'm actually just gonna go quit. Why not? Probably much better at dual wielding. Hey. So yes. you return to us with the lightsaber in hand, as I knew you would. The Force has served you well. You took a great risk in acquiring the artifact. You used your mind and your power. No peaceful meditation. No pacifism. Sometimes you must fight in order to achieve. Yeah. This gives you your Especially passion. This makes giant you monster. This is what makes you superior. Yeah, what the heck were you that expecting? That is the lesson we teach with that part of the final test. Do you understand? I want to say I actually... I don't believe you. True. But most would say they fight only when they must, or not at all. We are the ones who know that struggle is what makes us superior. When a Jedi acts, it is with skill, true. But the Jedi teach you that your passions are counterproductive. That strength is only found in peace. Did you not feel a moment of excitement in the tomb? Did your passions not flow and make you feel stronger and more... Uh, what purpose would you serve really. by restricting yourself from sight? I felt kind of annoyed. I would say only the purpose of the Jedi. Through this, Stupid. they would control you and restrict your potential. I would say I actually... Perhaps not to someone of your natural strength. The point is in the recognition of the nature of the act, rather than its sheer difficulty. If you came to the Academy, you must have felt the stirrings within you that cry out for the freedom of the dark side. Uh, that cry out for release. I can only show you the path that will lead to power and superiority. You have followed it this far. You must decide if you are capable of continuing. Okay, let me just look at the video again. for us to send the icon. This is where your path ends, young one. There is no turning back once you have embarked on it. Well... Good. The last part of your test will now commence. All life must compete in order to... So it is the same amongst the Sith. Compete or... So it behooves you in this final test to strike down... Normally, this would be against another student. You, however, get a special treat. You talk too much, old fool. So, you know, do you? Well, it makes no difference. You have become too ambitious, Uthura. It is time for you to die. No, it is time for you to die, Master. My Sadly, Uthura, it is you who are mistaken. You are indeed a fool if you think to oppose us, but... <laughs> This makes no sense. You will never become a Sith if you turn on us both. What could you hope to accomplish? Betrayed. He is a spy. Do not fret, my dear. All will be... No. My strength leaves me. <laughs> you morons. <laughs> you will pay for this. You... You... Damn you. My blood burns. You will never leave here. Well, guess what? Well, I think that's the fight dark side. 
need a food. <laughs> this makes no sense. Betrayed. Do not fret, my dear. All will be... The poison. You will never leave. <laughs> I'm just gonna wear this from now on. Quickly, just get the heck out of here. Ha! Alright, I'll see you all later. Bye.